Wisconsin's Department of Health Services has announced that food share households in the state of Wisconsin would receive the maximum monthly food share benefit amount, this time for the month of April. You can expect these benefits to be available on your Quest card as of April 25th. This is the food share emergency allotment, and it looks a little different for April, and we'll talk about that in just a moment. But just a reminder that food share benefits overall are about 15% higher than they were in some of the months we experienced in 2020. That's thanks to the COVID relief legislation signed into law at the end of 2020. That extension, that extra 15%, runs through at least June of 2021. Let's talk about what happened on April 1st. The U.S. Department of Agriculture announced a new policy that will provide additional food assistance benefits to those lowest income SNAP or food share participants. This is on top of that 15% increase we just talked about. This ensures that the minimum increase in food benefit is at least $95 per month. So everyone will get at a minimum a $95 emergency allotment. So recall in past months, people already getting the maximum food share monthly amount were not able to get an emergency allotment. And that's what's changed. Those people getting the maximum food share monthly amount will now be able to get $95 on top of that. Now, the guidance does say this is effective in April. So you could expect to see this new benefit. And that means some people will be seeing an emergency allotment for the first time in April. Here's an example of a dollar amount. A household of one getting the maximum food share benefit amount of $234 will see an April benefit amount increased by $95. So your new monthly amount will be $329. Now, there will be some other people that get a little bump as well. That would be someone who was close to the maximum before will also see an increase. The amount of the increase will be the difference between that $95 amount and the amount you were getting in an emergency allotment in March. Now, the emergency allotment is authorized by the Families First Coronavirus Response Act. Wisconsin almost lost this benefit. The Wisconsin Supreme Court voted to undo the state's emergency order. Wisconsin's Governor Tony Evers worked closely with the U.S. Department of Agriculture and actually secured the additional food support. And it's because we now have an emergency order in effect, a declaration made by our health secretary designee, Karen Timberlake. In a statement, secretary designee Timberlake reminds us that the extra food support goes to low-income individuals and families who then spend that money in the local community, at grocery stores, gets passed on to farmers, to truckers, to small businesses, and the community as a whole. A couple resources in the description below. You can read more from Governor Evers on saving the food share dollars. More on the USDA, that April 1st increase. You can also read more on the American Rescue Plan, some proposed changes to continue to increase food share benefits through the summer. If you also have not received food share benefits yet and would like to apply, we give you the link on how to do so.